Deep within the pages of Irish folklore, a chilling tale is whispered, a tale that casts an eerie shadow on the human understanding of life and death. The tale of the Banshee, an ominous figure who exists as a harbinger of life's most certain eventuality, death. The Banshee, a spectral female spirit, is an embodiment of fear and foreboding. Her sole purpose, as the legend goes, is to roam the landscapes of Ireland, wailing and crying outside homes. Her mournful cries, a deadly omen of an impending family death. Each sorrowful note, a chilling echo of the end that awaits a member of the house she chooses to haunt. Her cries, much like the wails of a woman in deep sorrow, strike a disquieting chord in the hearts of those who hear them. It is said, once you hear the Banshee's wail, an unexplainable dread takes hold of you, freezing you in your tracks and filling your heart with an ever-growing sense of dread. It's as if her cries have the power to make the living feel the cold touch of death, her voice a harsh reminder of the transient nature of human life. This isn't just a simple cry, it's a lament, a dirge for the living, a morbid serenade which announces an impending family death in the most harrowing way imaginable. The Banshee does not discriminate. Her cries are a universal portent, cutting through the peace of the night, a chilling echo of what's to come. The Banshee, a figure intertwined with the fabric of Irish folklore, is a spine-chilling reminder of our mortality. She serves as a darkened mirror, reflecting our own fears of death back at us. However, despite the fear she instills, the Banshee remains an integral part of Irish culture, a spectral figure that haunts not just the nights and homes of the Irish countryside, but also the human psyche, representing our own innate fears of the unknown and the inevitable.